Macron ici le nom de notre président, protecteur des ultra riches, protecte les the super riches. Donc Macron est le nom de notre président, Emmanuel Macron est un. Il est 41 ans. Et quand il a été élevé, il a promis de changer tout. Il a changé changé beaucoup de choses. Il a baissé les taxes. Collecting more taxes. And, uh, well, touchy subject. Anyway, a lot of people are, are really um, disappointed. More than your country. We're disappointed in ours. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, who is not disappointed by uh, its uh, well, leader? Well, in Europe, um, a lot of people complain, and uh, yeah, there's uh, there's more and more the gap between the poor and the rich is uh, it's wider and wider, and uh, yeah, and uh, this is not good. <laughs> Try to carry um, petrol and gas. Oh wow! Wow! How much it has increased? Well, it has increased progressively. It doesn't. It has not increased overnight. You know, progressively from one euro, one euro twenty. Now it's one, one sixty for uh, diesel, diesel. Um, so um. It's not, uh, maybe they increased last time a few cents, you know, it's just not that much. But in the end, people are, are just fed up because it is, uh, well, maybe 10, 10 cents actually. But it changes a lot to people, uh, or people like you and me, or companies. For companies, it's uh, some working in transports, it's, uh, so this, it's huge, you know. And they also lowered the speed limit from 90 to 80. So imagine the consequences for uh, people in transports because they cannot drive as fast. And then they have to have a certain number of drivers who are only allowed to drive a certain amount of hours. Well, it's just 
the two measures, I think, uh, and collided and just exactly. Yeah. So, uh, but apparently, the, in other countries, uh, prices are not always cheaper, and the minimum wage is lower. I mean, people clearly from in Spain, in Spain or Portugal, the minimum wage is net less than 600 euros, and apparently the price of gas, petrol, is the same as here, and people. Uh, yeah, uh, I've not complained as strong as in as in France. I don't say that should, we should complain here, but yeah, more than seventy percent of the price of petrol is taxed. So the government wants to collect more money, but has decided to also suppress some taxes. For instance, on the um, what do you call that? Council tax is going to be lowered. That was one of the measures promised by the president, but in return, <laughs> you know, uh, other taxes are, yeah. have increased. Well, you cannot suppress uh, taxes okay. and just expect the same amount of um, spendings. So, yeah, we don't have a clear view of uh, what exactly is spent, where and how much is collected. But that's an easy way to collect money. Of course. choice to live in the countryside, so far away from their working place, well, they have, you know, they, it's a, yeah, it's, it's, well, you know that, it's a budget, even if our distances in Europe are shorter than what they may be uh, in the US, um, it's a car is a huge cost. So we don't know how long it's going to last. And, um, and wearing those uh, yellow cardigans, there are other groups also uh, uh, gathering under this excuse, but doing much worse stuff, you know, uh, breaking. And, uh, so it's difficult to control and we don't know if it's the beginning of more uh, serious events or but our president has not reacted to, didn't say it would change a thing so he commented on brexit on many other news but not on this it thanks to ignore it and, well, to start with. Enjoy this afternoon if you're going to visit set and uh, enjoy the cruise and don't forget to come back here later and spend more time to, to visit the surroundings. Again, uh, public transports are good and, and lines or train lines also. Make sure please you don't forget anything.